Welcome back. I just wanted to come on here and give you a quick update. There's a story I'm going to be working on later on this afternoon or tonight. I, I can't stay here where I'm at. But I just wanted to come on and give you a quick update and a heads up that I will be putting that video out probably either later on today or tonight. If not, the first thing in the morning. I am getting information from multiple sources that FEMA is a disaster in this disaster relief. Go figure. The federal response here is an epic fail. They are... Like I said, I'm getting information from multiple sources here, from subscribers, uh, from people on the ground. I, I'm doing the research for this story, and what I am seeing is just an absolute disaster for the disaster relief. Um, the Biden administration, the federal assistance, the, the FEMA, e everything on, at the corporate and, and uh, well, at the federal level, is wanting to work with corporate entities. They're not wanting to work with private individuals. They're not wanting to work with people on the ground that know these people, that know how to get into these areas. They're actively blocking these people, and they're wanting to put on a big display with their corporate buddies, you know, to get them to have the relief coming in. I can't give all of the information right now. I don't have everything in front of me, but like I'm saying, I'm working on the story. It'll either come out hopefully today sometime, if not first thing in the morning. This is just a quick preview of what the story is about and what I'm working on here. Multiple sources are reporting this. Every any Anything and everything at um, anyone at the uh, local level is saying basically the same thing that FEMA is an epic fail. It is absolutely an epic fail. They are not listening to local people. They are not wanting local help. They are not wanting help from people in the area. I've even heard that FEMA is blocking and confiscating much needed equipment to get into this area because they're wanting to get it from their corporate buddies. I mean, that is just absolutely unthinkable that they would do this. They, they would stoop to this level. Let me get the story together. Let me put it together. Let me get everything going on and I will bring you the story and show you what I'm talking about. Folks, this is bad, and it's getting worse, and I'm hearing information here that the body count is stacking up, and it's getting worse by the day because these people can't get the aid that they need. I mean, that is the ultimate bad sacrifice in a situation like this. These people are desperate. They are out without food. They're without water. They're without supplies. A lot of people are still trapped in these areas that are inaccessible. Local people are trying to get in, and FEMA is blocking them. I mean, you just can't imagine anything worse than that. Let me get this story together. I'm going to put it out, like I said, tonight, hopefully, maybe in the morning. And I'm going to show you how bad it's getting over there. In the meantime, you guys be safe out there. Try to take care of one another. And uh, let's just do the best we can in this bad situation. I'll bring you all the information that I have as soon as I can get it put together and put it out for you. If there's any way that we can help here, I will put my uh, email down in the link down in the description my email link down in the description give me any information that you have that you need to get out and i will put it out in that video in the meantime you guys be safe and watch out for each other take care